everybody and thank you so much for coming back to my channel my name is amanda yandelo and i'm really excited that you're here and that you're back um if you have not watched my previous video i just did a bit of a q a about some of the frequently asked questions that i get um being vegan for five years so if you want to check that out i recommend it uh so i just want to share with you guys some research options for you as i said um before i highly recommend if you're new to being vegan or if you're thinking about being vegan, or even if you've been vegan for like 20 years, I think it's really important to keep up on research and learning and growth. Uh, I'm, I'm a huge believer in that. So definitely uh, continue to to learn about yourself and, and the world around you. So um, I have a few books that I want to mention. Now I only have two of the books here with me physically. The other two I brought from a library years ago and I obviously had to give them back. So I don't have them with me right now, but I will link them down below for you. So I'll go into detail a little bit about both. Um, so one of the main questions I get is, well, why are you doing your research? The biggest reason to do your research is so that you have the knowledge. Uh, my mom always tells me knowledge is power. So it's really important to, you know, gain that information and be able to support yourself. You know, um, it's evidence right? It's evidence to support your beliefs and your values. And um, it just, it helps to really instill in you why you're choosing to do this. So yeah, uh, definitely do your research friends. All right. So uh, these are the two books I'm going to show you today. This book, funnily enough, has absolutely nothing to do with being vegan, but I'm recommending it to you because it's a phenomenal book on self-discovery and building your own journey. So this is uh, written by Lily Collins. It's called Unfiltered, No Shame, No Regrets, Just Me. I'm a big, big fan of Lily Collins. I think she's absolutely phenomenal. And uh, yeah, she's just, she's wonderful. But this book is, is really great. She talks a lot about building a relationship with herself. Uh, she talks a lot about uh, how she dealt with disordered eating, which for me really resonated. And just recognizing that when you build a solid relationship with yourself, your relationship with others only gets better. And I think that that's, that's a really important part about being vegan as well, is you really start to kind of understand and become more connected to yourself, to the environment, to um, our planet, our, our animals, our nature. Like, I just think you just become more aware. So definitely check out this book. I think she's really wonderful. And she does it in such a way that uh, is not preaching in any way. It's just her speaking from her own experiences and saying, hey, here's some advice for you. This is probably the advice I'd give to my younger self. Uh, definitely holding on to this. Uh, and I've, you can already see that I've flagged a few spots that are my favorite. So highly recommend because uh, I'll definitely be reading this for years to come. It's a great, great book. Uh, the second book I want to recommend is The Clear Skin Diet. This is actually written by two of my favorite YouTubers, uh, Nina and Miranda Nelson who are phenomenal. If you've not checked out their YouTube channel, go do it. You need to do it. Uh, this is, it's an amazing book, but it's also forwarded by Dr. John McDougall, who also wrote The Starch Solution. And that is one of the other books that I want to mention in regards to research. Uh, I'll just read a little bit about it for you. Uh, so it says, Nina and Randa Nelson are now sharing their own remarkable transformation with the millions who have up to now felt powerless to obtain optimal skin health. Their vibrant story is a gift for those who can now feel empowered to achieve similar glowing results. So that is by Caldwell uh, Azdolson, which is another MD. So if you look at the back of this book, literally 90% of these comments are by doctors. This book is, it, it does talk about be, having like a six week clear skin diet um, because it's saying, you know, from start to finish of that six weeks, you should have completely clear skin. So if you only choose to follow this for six weeks, then yes, I guess it would be a diet. But if you're choosing to go into it into a more like healthy lifestyle, vegan lifestyle, high carb, low fat, you will see these dramatic results for years to come. Uh, I fell in love with this book. It's absolutely amazing i highly recommend it uh it's it's great because it has a lot of really excellent um recipes in the back and you can see again i flagged some information what i really really loved about this book as well is it talks about um, a list of pore clogging comedogenic ingredients so 
if you're um, into makeup and skincare, you know that everything you put on your face can affect your skin, right? So this is interesting because it talks a lot about that, right? Um, and uh, promoting, um, pr acne promoting ingredients. And it goes on for literally, guys, like almost two pages. It's insane. Um, so there's a lot of really, really interesting information in here. It talks about treatments, that you can use topical treatments. Um, but what I really find amazing about this book is that it talks about your health from the inside out, right? Which I think is so, so important. I think we spend uh, so much money as a society on products to make our skin look great on the outside, maybe covering up with foundation or, you know, all the skincare, but we're not realizing that it really comes from the inside out. So drinking lots of water, eating healthy whole foods, plant-based, it's what's really gonna help you. So um, I highly recommend this book. As I, I said, it's great because there's a lot of interesting recipes, excellent recipes, a list of um, recommended makeup products in here as well and skincare products, phenomenal. And I also really like this book because it is backed up by doctors as well. So you're not just picking up a book from the shelf that's like, go vegan and it's like not backed up right um <laughs> again it's the evidence you know it's the, the proof is in the pudding this the proof is in the vegan pudding it's this is amazing highly recommend go check it out uh the other two books that i'm going to recommend are again the starch solution which uh follows very closely to the skincare book that i was just showing you uh the clear skin diet and the china study uh those books follow quite closely to the way I eat, which is high carb, low fat. So not eating very much fat, like eating very low, like I don't eat oil, I don't add oils to my products. Um, I eat very low avocado, I don't really eat avocado, um, but I eat very low fat. Um, that doesn't mean that I don't eat fat or that I'm fat phobic, definitely not. But for my skin, a lot of fat, including nut butters and stuff, does really spark agitation in my skin. So I choose to eat more whole foods, high carb, plant-based. Um, but there's other kinds of uh, vegan um, options. So it, some people are more higher fat. Um, some people choose to be raw, vegan. Again, you might wanna do your own research in whichever way you're choosing to go. It's what's best for you. Uh, so, you know, don't, don't worry if you're not doing what everyone else is doing. Just make sure that you do your research and you're really listening to your body and doing what feels best for you. Uh, another thing that I highly recommend, this is just from me, a little last minute tip before I click out of this video, um, lots of water. Drink tons of water, keeps things moving, especially when you're first starting to be vegan. Uh, probably getting a lot more fiber and uh, stuff going on. And uh, yeah, your digestion will thank you. So drink tons of water. Um, and definitely check out these books if you're interested in learning more about being vegan and just a personal growth journey. Highly recommend. So um, I hope that this helps. If you know of any other books that I might like to read about be being vegan or a vegan journey or research, please let me know below because I'm always interested in reading more. And if you have any questions or concerns about being vegan or um, any other options for you as far as reading material um, or websites and such, just leave me a comment down below. I'd be happy to help and support you where I can. Uh, if you get time, you know, to, to start and to really reflect as being in a quarantine situation. So um, thank you so much for joining and uh, please click the subscribe button if you're interested in more videos. Uh, I post every week, every Sunday. So you'll get more information about being vegan, healthy plant-based lifestyles, and of course, um, tons and tons of information in regards to fitness and what I eat in a day and some fashion and all that good stuff. So thanks again for joining me, everybody. And hope you're all having a great day. Bye.